Okay, getting to uh, an important story here. Two people in a Honda Civic die in Panorama City in a crash that police tell us was caused by two grand theft auto suspects trying to get away from officers. Yeah, Mario Ramirez is live at the accident scene now with the very latest details for us this morning. Mario, good morning. Good morning. LAPD officials say the vehicle involved in this high-speed chase, that stolen pickup truck, was just moments away from being tracked by a police helicopter with those units on the ground backing off. But unfortunately, the timing didn't work out. It was just too late before a violent crash here at this intersection of Woodman and Lenark, killing an innocent driver and passenger here in Panorama City. Take a look. Sky Fox showing you the scene from up above. The two vehicles involved in the crash left mangled. The suspects in the reported stolen truck survived. The LAPD says that pursuit began around 745 last night when Foothill Division officers responded to a Grand Theft Auto call near South Alvarado and Olympic. A black Toyota Tacoma reportedly stolen with at least two suspects inside. Authorities say when those suspects noticed police were following, they started taking evasive maneuvers, triggering lights and sirens and that pursuit. The suspects, they say, sped into Panorama City, driving north on Woodman Avenue from Cantera Street before crashing into a gray Honda Civic here at this intersection killing two innocent bystanders inside. Listen. In the course of initiating that pursuit, they were waiting for the air unit to respond in order to go into tracking mode. As the air unit came overhead, that suspect struck a vehicle that was going northbound on Woodman Avenue, and tragically, the two people that were inside of that vehicle have passed away as a result of that traffic collision with the suspects. And following the crash, the driver in the stolen pickup truck tried to take off on foot and was taken down with officers using a taser on him in a near nearby parking lot. The driver and passenger both in custody after being treated for injuries, now facing several felony charges, including vehicular manslaughter. Now, as for those two innocent bystanders in the gray Honda Civic, witnesses on the scene say it was two men in that vehicle back out here live, one pronounced dead on the scene, the other losing their life at the hospital from their injuries. And they haven't been named officially just yet, but uh, we expect to learn more here in just a few hours. For now, reporting live in Panorama City, we'll send it back to you. All right. Mario, thanks so much.